From her first moment at Meriwether High, Melinda Sordino knows she's an outcast. She busted an end of the summer party by calling the cops, a major infraction in high school society. So her old friends don't talk to her and people she doesn't know glare at her. She retreats into her head, where the lies and hypocrisy of high school stand in stark relief to her own silence, making her all the more mute. Her art teacher, Mr. Freeman, introduces her to a new form of expression where there's no need for words. But it's not so comfortable in her head either. There's something banging around in there that she doesn't want to think about. Try as she might to avoid it, it won't go away. Until a painful confrontation. Once that happens, she can't be silent. She must speak the truth. In this powerful novel, an utterly believable, bitterly ironic heroine speaks for many a disfranchised teenager, while learning that although it's hard to speak up for yourself, keeping your mouth shut is worse. <laughs>